Hi guys, welcome to Travel with Austin. I'm Austin, and today we are here in Indiana, and we're going to be showing off the Superintendent's Mansion here at the Indiana State Sanatorium. Now, a special shout out to Dawson and Adam for actually shooting this video for me. Um, although I was originally here with them, I did have to leave early because I got sick. And unfortunately, I was unable to record anything, but luckily they took it upon themselves um, to record footage of the places so I could still make some videos, which is really great of them. So thank you, Dawson and Adam. So without further ado, let's go ahead and explore. Now, I did explore this place originally when I came here back in 2022, I believe. And back then it was in more of its original state but you'll actually see that it is currently going through renovations, which is part of the reason why that this exploration is so short, because they are currently in the middle of a remodel. Now, according to the staff member that we talked to, their plan is to have this open by October of 2024, so probably around when this video comes out, or maybe a bit before this video comes out, and it's going to be an Airbnb type deal, um, bed, bed and breakfast type deal. I don't know if they said Airbnb specifically, but you'll be able to come here, rent out rooms, um, stay on the sanatorium property, and there is Starlink internet here. Um, so you do have internet. You won't have normal phone service unless something changes, but it definitely would be an interesting place to stay, and depending on the cost, I would definitely stay here especially since there are really no hotels nearby. So it would be a cool place to stay if you plan on doing a day room at the asylum. Now it is gonna be interesting to see how they manage people staying here with people who are doing overnight investigations, but we'll see all that in the future. And as you can see, they are going pretty quickly just because everything is currently just in a renovation state. Um, if you wanna see it in an unrenovated state, you can check out the video I did a few years ago here, which shows more of how it was beforehand and does cover both the basement and the attic as well. Now the attic was still original when we went here, but they unfortunately did not record it. And then outside, we're gonna take a look at the pool. Now, if you watch my old video here, I don't even know if I showed it off but this pool was filled in a few years ago. So it was completely filled in with dirt. They dug it out, um, put some water in it, and as you'll see in a second, there are actually goldfish in here, which is kind of crazy. They seem to be loving it, seem to be thriving. There were a lot of them. So I don't know what their plans are for the pool, but they did take the effort to dig it out. So I'm sure they plan on doing something with it. Anyway, that is just a quick look at the remodel of the superintendent's house. Hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. And again, thank you to Dawson and Adam for filming these for me since I had to leave early. I will see you guys next time with a brand new video. Thanks for watching.